I nominated the RCMP Heritage Centre when COVID started because of all the things they did for us since that time. And they hosted our monthly meetings. And when families needed a place to host a funeral prior to being interred at the cemetery, then they also did that for us there. So they really reached out and supported the RCMP family. You know, we have our, our coffee clutch uh, on a weekly basis and everybody throws a toonie in the pot. At the end of the calendar year, the veterans community and the centre together donate that money to the Leader Post Christmas Cheer Fund. So people that need it are, during the holiday season benefit from it. This year, we're probably up over $1,600 that we will donate. Uh, I see that closeness growing between the staff of the centre and the Veterans Association. I think sometimes the frontline people are, are underrated and over, overlooked. They're the ones that uh, do the most for us. And so I, I think just to give them a huge thank you for their support of the RCMP, of the RCMP veterans community and the good work they do.